Farmers, and welcome back to Mega Walls. And I have Bacon Bug, the amazingly amazing of greasiness. I'm greasy. You're you're a strip. You're a piece of bacon. Yeah, I know, but I don't really want to be a greaser. That's Bacon Bug's new job. Being See, a greaser is a job. Secret, secretly, she works at Burger King. What she does is that. She goes there, and then they're wondering, Oh, what happened to all the bacon? It's don't work so perfect. Okay? It just shows you, and you just have, um, you just have a bunch of packs of bacon, like, in your arms, and you're like, What bacon? And then you put it behind your back. I don't have a job. <laughs> We're poor kids. Give us money. Okay, anyway, that's enough of the... Drama! Okay. <laughs> okay, but now it is time for Mega Walls! And what map should we do? Wait, is there any new ones? No, um, let's do Forsaken. I'm gonna be a skeleton. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna be a skeleton as well. Okay, let's be the Forsaken. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Uh, there's four. There's not enough people. Um, okay, um, just, just wait! Patience is the answer! Trust me, it is. So what do you want to talk about? I'm fabulous at drawing. Whatever. And lag. Okay, how about we see who can do the weirdest sound effects and comment down below who wins. Round one. Okay, you go first. I'm the fan. Weirdest sound effect you can make. There's three, there's three uh, rounds. Let's see who can win. You go first. Okay, um, this section is, um, is normal. Oh, wait, try and join blue team again. I'm in. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, I you don't know what sound to make. Okay, do you want me, do you want me to make the first one? Sure. Okay, there's what the first one. <laughs> And what I can do is I can, I can like slur a little bit on my tongue, but then it just goes into a machine gun to its end. Um, okay, what's yours? Okay, what's yours? I still have no clue. Okay, bacon bug forfeits. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I forfeit. <laughs> okay, you sh do I do round two by myself? Yeah, do it by yourself. Oh man, this is gonna be a tough one. I don't know if, if I'm gonna win or if I'm gonna win. Oh, so very tough. Um, I need to look to you. What do I choose? Who do I choose? I need medical attention. Um, okay, I, I, I have an idea. Huh. How about we say a couple of real life stories? Okay, um, like maybe the first one could be craziest, second could be weird. Wait no. First one could be the craziest, second one could be the funniest, so the third one could be the creepiest. Wait, no, not creepiest. Um What should the third section be? Um uh, most damaging. Most damaging. Okay. Um first one is the um the funniest, I we know not the funniest. Um, the um, okay, let's actually make the first one the coolest. Okay, you go first for the coolest. Coolest story? Yeah. Um, I don't have very many stories. That are interesting, anyway. Story time with Bacon Book. Um, I guess the um. Oh, so this is, this, is, this is gonna be deep, okay? It's gonna be really Got deep. It. I, I'm making it deep. I'm making it deep. No, no. I'm making it so deep that it's in your skull. Okay, okay. It's gonna be really deep, alright? Okay, okay. 
coolest story I know of. Okay. That's, that's uh, to me. Okay, good. Okay. All these did stories you, have to have. Did you ready for this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is gonna be really deep. Okay. okay. Really deep. Okay. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm so excited! My life. Ah, that's so incredible! No, I seriously do not have a cool story. Oh, come on! Okay, just tell a random story then. Um. I need a topic, because I'm not good at thinking of these Um, okay, um, 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 I bet you're just gonna turn around and say, and your, your face is the weirdest. Your face is not a story. So it's a it's a story. Do, 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 do. Your face is not a story. I do not see words on it. Uh, I'm sorry, but if you look over here on this guy's shirt, boom, there's a story. There's a story. It's just a letter E. I know. Why don't you it's, put a letter E on the back of the soup? I don't know. I mean, like okay, but you need to tell your story. Hey, teenager applying for a job with the letter E on his back. <laughs> hey, I would like the job for um, working with the president. Okay, and first thing you have to do, first candy. thing you have to do to enter this is that you have to take out the Larry. No way, man! I'm gonna go work somewhere else. Ah, the Can we fix it? No, we can't. Um. Okay. Um. I guess I'll tell a story. Um. Coolest. Um. Actually, I want to change the first one to scariest. Scariest. Do you have a scary story? Um, like the scary story that happened to you? Uh. Um. Okay, I'll tell the first one. Okay. Once upon a time. No, once in, upon a time. In yeah, the no. land of land. The United States of America. <laughs> yeah, America. Okay, but anyway, um, what happened was okay. Okay, um. When I was like 10 years old. Oh no, nine, I'm gonna say nine. Okay, we went to the courthouse and they have um, rock climbing. And so I said, um, okay, I saw my dad and my uncle and my um, sister were um, sort of riding the ropes, but not on the, um, the rock. They were sort of like swinging like Tarzan. Uh -huh. So I said, I wanna do that. Guess what happened? I swing, then I fall straight on my face onto the rubber padding. It I couldn't breathe for a full five seconds. Oh. And that was probably one of the scariest moments of my life. Oh. Um, can I also throw in the coolest? Sure. Um, okay. Okay, this is actually a true story. Okay. At my school, they we had a raffle um, for um, the winner, the first place winner of uh, the whole entire school, like 300 people would get an iPad mini. Second place would get Beats headphones and third place would get um, iTunes gift card. But anyway, what was awesome is that I won by selling a hundred tickets. <laughs> but um, I won the iPad mini and I had to say it was just so awesome because I just ran out say the one thing that matters in the universe. Ready? I said, screaming out loud, it actually happened. America! I just screamed America on the top of my lungs. I even have the three, there's even three pictures of um, the winners. Like the, and like the um, $50 for iTunes um, person. It just looks like he's handing them to him. Um, for the um, second place, it looks like it's handed to him. Um, first place, me. It just shows me with the iPad in the air running, smiling joyfully. Well it's just, <laughs> I just like that. It's just one of my favorite stories. That it actually pr happened pretty. Um, I actually still have the iPad. <gasps> Excuse me. It's pretty cool. Okay. D okay. Th okay. Let's just tell random stories. Okay. I think we're extending this really long, but um, but it's still story time. Oh, we should do this yeah. every video. Okay. It's your turn to tell a story. Come on. What type of story? Any story. Um. Oh, hello, brother. Yeah, get out of my face. Eh. Eh. 
Tell a story. Come on. I know. All these visual effects fabulous. Tell a story. Come on. Story. 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 Stop the time. Story. Okay. Okay. Ready? Okay. Do you have a story? Um. Wait, I need to type a story. Um, okay, what kind of stories do you have? Hmm, I don't know. Yeah, just tell me the time because I don't think I have one of them. Um, the one that, um, that hurt the most, I guess. Is that, do you have one for that? What hurt the most? Yeah, like, most painful. Oh, <laughs> Oh, do I you have a story like for that? Yes, everybody! We have a story. Where's ba Okay, we gotta go interview Bacon Bug. Break down the door. Bacon Bug, what would you like to say about your story? Okay, so I was like five or six, I think. Oh, and this is gonna be good. Did you hit into a wall? Huh? Huh? No. Okay. No. Um, but still. And I think it was about a month after we had taken the training wheels off my bike. Oh. oh and. and this game. A d recipe for disaster, I can tell, but still keep and going on. You know how I have a gravel road and everything? Yes! Oh no! Is that, is that the same skin as your dad? Oh um, no. Oh gosh, we're having so much lag. But, okay, so, and you know I have a, I have a gravel road and everything. Yeah. Okay, so, we went to the gravel road and everything, and then we went on a bike ride uh, down to the other uh, street and then back to my house. And so like my dad and my brother and everything. Yeah. And then what ended up happening is once we hit, because the other road, uh, that's the same name, but it's like the southeast road, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, it's actually made, it's like pavement. It's oh. not gravel, like mine. Yeah. And what happened was after we got back onto my road, which is made of gravel, um, I... It was like transitioning right from the pavement to the gravel and I was racing my brother and I went too fast and my bike almost flipped over and I fell and then my dad was quite a ways ahead so he didn't even know I had fallen and Isn't that like, the worst? Yeah. And then what happens is like I'm I don't really feel any pain. I'm I feel perfectly fine, and then about five minutes later, I, well, no, like two minutes later, I just pretty much bumbling on the gravel, holding my knee, because it's like covered in blood and stuff, and no pain and agony. Okay. And then we get back, and like, clean it up and wrap and stuff, and then what ends up happening, about um, seven years later, I still have a scar on my knee, and for about four years after it healed, there has been a rock stuck in my knee, essentially. Like a tiny little pebble just stuck in my knee. Uh, where but now I you have a rock knee! Mm, sort of. Instead of acne, you have rock knee! <laughs> Oh, I also have another painful story. It's oh, and wait, it's my turn, it's my turn. Okay, okay, this is an embarrassing story. Bacon okay, Bug no, knows this really well. Um, This happened at our old school. It's no. me and my reputation with ripping my pants. I actually don't remember that. I, okay, if you, okay, you guys don't know me. I rip my pants so often. It's just like, Wait. I even recorded me time. ripping my pants on accident trying to make a quesadilla! What the heck? Okay, but, <laughs> but anyways, what happens is that, um, like, pretty much I ripped my pants. Okay, this was at our old school. Okay, what happens is this. We go to our school. Oh, good starting in 30 seconds. Okay, but uh, we'll still tell stories. But what happens is that, um, at my old school, okay, I'm just wearing my pants, just shorts. I always wear shorts, but anyway, what happens is this. I'm walking around, then I rip my pants on one of the, you know that playground structure that, on the, the monkey bars, the monkey bars. 
I got, I, okay, there was a, like a, a chipped paint that my pants got caught in there. And so I was stuck there for a second, but then I plummeted down and I whacked my Three, two, and, one, game set. Okay, anyway, I whacked my face on there and what happens is this. Ready? Uh -huh. Um, my pants ripped completely. Like, my two leggings were both ripped and my, um, between my legs was ripped so I pretty much had to like run around the trees and stuff just to try and get away so that way I could actually get um, like to, to call my mom to get my pants and at my old school this happened maybe like three times and um nowadays okay when I first started a new school um once I started a new school guess what happened the first day of the new school, I ripped my pants. What's funny is that my- Okay, what, what, one of my friends walks by the office to grab some, and, and my friend's like, Chris, you already ripped your pants? Because they're from the old school, and I- And we know, they didn't say that, they said, Chris, what did you get in trouble for now? And I'm like, I didn't get in trouble, I ripped my pants! And, <laughs> so many people were sort of giving me the um, the I feel sorry for you look every time they walked by the office because I had my they, I would I, I just had a piece okay I wrapped my entire leg that was ripped with toilet paper it looked so incredibly weird it, it just it just felt like oh gosh this is the worst day of my life because of my ripped pants I even I okay I think in the last three weeks I ripped three pairs of pants. Jeez, what is this one pants? And we are back. I ran out of memory, which stunk. I don't know how much we got out. Okay, but um, it's your turn anyway, Bacon Bug. Wait, should we go with embarrassing story? Okay, do you have an embarrassing story? No. Dang. I'm pretty sure you do, you just don't want to say it on camera. Well, I don't remember any if I do have any. Okay, um, but... Okay, um, you can say any story now. No, and also, going off of your previous story, you should get some leather pants. Yeah, I should get... You get, like, leather pants? No, we can make you cosplay as Edward Elric every day. Wear armor? No, that's Alphonse. But, like, I have... Edward is the short one. Okay, um, so do you have any stories? Because remember, you said you had another painful story. Oh, yeah! Okay, so do you want the full story? Like, um, well, we do have happened? a lot of time, so go for it. Knock yourself out. I told a really uh, long story about ripping my pants, and that seemed to be satisfying. No, so it's, uh, it's the longer story, because I'm telling, like, the full story, and then about halfway through it, I'll get to the pain part, and then I'll go to Okay, the that's it. fine, that's fine. Okay. Oh, where are you? Oh, there you are. Are you gonna get, like, some iron and stuff soon? I already did. Oh. How much? Um, about a stack. Oh, okay. That'll work. Uh, so... I'm gonna go mine. We have a lot of field trips, and yeah. last year, in I think it was sixth grade. Okay, yeah. What happened was we went on a field trip to a place called Opal Creek. Oh, I wish I could go there. And you are going to go there. Just remember that. Yeah. If your parents let you, anyways. And I... pretty much what's going on there is that um. We have this really cool bus driver that works for our school. Is he like I the forgot. bus driver from The Simpsons Auto? No. Yo, but what's up, I forgot, dudes? I forgot what his name was, but he's awesome. And he pretty much, half the time, he will actually stay with us on the field trips. Now that's an awesome bus driver. So like with the overnight field trips and stuff, oh, he will stay nice. with us. Oh, I got a chest. Oh, dude, and, I am set with food. I have so much food. And, and so, we get onto the bus and everything to go to Opal Creek. 
It's about an hour and a half to two hour drive to get there. Yeah. And once we get there, um, like there's this little parking area and we pretty much just park the bus there. Everyone gets off and we throw the luggage into one of Opal Creek's vans to send it over to the campsite. Yeah. With like all the, uh, the uh, cabins and stuff. And Oh gosh, give me a second. Gosh, we got the luck. Okay, go. And, um, because what we do is we give them all of our stuff in, like, in the, into the van, and then- Give me all your stuff go. and I don't kill you! <laughs> and then we have to go on a three-mile hike <laughs> to get there. Uh, like, uh, the actual cabin. I have the next story. Uh, let me finish mine. I know. Last name, really. I'm patient. And, so essentially, what happens is like we do the really long hike, the teachers tell us some really cool stuff, and then we get to the cabins and we like situate ourselves and everything, we have a little snack, and we do some learning stuff like we would do since we're in like environmental school. Um, and then what happens after that is... Explosions! My teacher, she says that we might be able to go swimming because the creek might be warm enough this year. And, um, well, last Oh, I can just imagine. Okay, ready? Okay, um, th this isn't long. Like, what happens is this. Oh, I'm sorry, kids. The, the water's not hot enough. Then uh, just a fat kid just runs and like, and he body slams in there. And then, um, and the teacher's like, um, you know, it's cold in there. And and he's like, no, it's not. And then you just hear this loud, like gurgle with bubbles, just. And then and there's like steam coming out of the water. And he's like, yep, it's ready. Okay, but anyway, can continue with your story. <laughs> and so she said that it might be warm enough to go swimming, so everyone's all excited and stuff. Yay! And a lot of people, like, bring their, uh, like, swimsuits and stuff because they said it ahead of time. And also two minutes before the walls fall down. And, um, pretty much, I didn't bring mine because I wasn't intending on swimming. I was probably just gonna, You're like, hardcore. roll up my jeans a little bit. I was probably just gonna, like, roll up my jeans a little bit and then just... Um, like walk through it a little bit yeah. and probably hang out with one of my teachers because he didn't really want to use that. Like, because they also have this really cool thing, it's like, it's like a butt slide pretty much, but it's inside of the creek and it's just covered in uh, moss and it's all natural and water will just flow up to the top of it and then it just rushes down really fast into a big pool and people will just like ride down it pretty much and it's apparently really fun I didn't actually do it um, and what I was intending on doing was just probably hanging out with one of my teachers and like skipping rocks or something but what ended up happening was while people were crossing the creek to get to the butt slide oh I think I know the story yes yes you do I told it to you before and while people were crossing the creek to get to the butt slide, oh! Um, one of my teachers, like I was slipping a little bit, and one of my teachers uh, gave me a hand and tried to help me out a little bit. I'm, I'm begging, like, here you go. Uh, and what ended up happening was essentially I slipped. Oh, and yes, I know the story. Yes, yes. And do you have an iron helmet yet? I already gave you one. Oh, you didn't? Oh, yeah, you did. I did. And I Sheep slipped. Sheep never lie. I slipped on a very, very mossy rock. Unusually mossy. And Are you ready? I the apocalypse is here. No, walls have fallen. And Close I fell. enough. And I ended up falling. And, like, hitting my knee. Yep. And my friend. And then what happened? Wonderful thing. <laughs> One of my other friends, uh, Keely, she ended up falling in too. Oh. But she, <laughs> fell her, she fell on her back though when she had her back. Oh, off I, okay. I, wait, I can't imagine this. Okay. 
the girls just love you like <laughs> you <laughs> bacon bug fell off and you're like angry and then you just grab her like and you just toss her in, and you're saying this is opal creek <laughs> she, she's just crying away and you and you just put on shades and you're like cry away girl cry away no, what actually ended up happening was she fell too, and then, um... She fell in the way I said it. <laughs> Say this, this oh, well, Pretty much what happened is, she had, like, her phone in her back pocket. Oh, reason. yes! The sweet, the sweet, sweet and little problem. I don't know why she had her phone with her, but she had her phone with her, and she's like, and she, then she falls, and she pretty much just starts freaking out because she, like, dropped her phone in the water and everything. Oh, gee, and, my phone, my phone, my phone! And she's not injured at all. She's perfectly fine. And then I'm over here trying to get help from one of my teachers attempting to get up after falling extremely hard on my leg. Uh, I hate it when, like, the teachers are like, caring about the last no part. no consent for me. Like, no feelings, nothing. While I was, like, slowly, almost crying. Um, you're, the um, they're like, hey, Bacon Bug, why are you helping us with with the girl? And you're like, uh, I don't know. There's blood coming on my my thing. I fell on a rock. What's the difference? And you're like, uh, and they're just like, um, I'm just going to go take care of her. <laughs> and just walks uh, away. And then what happened after one of my teachers helped me get uh, back up is... You fell again on the mossy stone. No, no, I didn't. Um, after almost falling on my face multiple times attempting to get up, I finally got back up onto the bank, and uh, one of my teachers helped me get to a somewhat safe spot where I wouldn't fall on my face. And... We talked for a little bit. I pulled out one of the books that I had because I didn't really plan on going swimming. And then what happened is I had to sit there on a rock that was perfectly, perfectly shaped like a chair. <laughs> and nice. just pretty much watch the entirety of my class have the time of their lives while I was like grabbing my knee in pain. Oh, that's the worst. So I was in pain in the corner, my friends were having the time of their lives. Um, the lag is just... I think the... So much lag. Okay, um... Okay, your story time. Oh, um... I'm trying to think of a good one. You said you had one. Forget it after um, all my storytelling yeah, in my pain. Um, Agony. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to think of one that you will remember. Um, Doesn't matter if I don't remember. Um, oh, I think you know. Oh, okay. Um, I think you remember this one. Okay. At our old school, the Devil's Lair. No, I, I'm just kidding. The school is actually kind of cool. Um, but anyway. Yeah, some of the people were jerks. Yeah. <clears throat> People. <clears throat> no. But anyway, what happens is that. Um, <laughs> okay, I, I got really tired during class, so during recess, I decided uh, I'll just sleep on the bed. Oh, I remember that. Yes, and um, <laughs> like I'm just laying hot dog style. I'm just laying hot dog style, and then randomly these two kids are um keep on sitting on me in different places. It was getting really awkward. But then the worst part happened. One of them sat on my kneecap. Oh, that was so painful. If you don't know that, knee the kneecap sat down on solid wood is painful. It was just so painful. Was that in third grade? Was that third or fourth grade? Um, I'm pretty sure that was actually fifth grade. Wait, fourth, fourth. I'm gonna go with fourth. Okay, and <laughs> that's pretty much the story of. Wait, wait, you fell asleep during recess, right? Yeah, and like I'm, they're like, come on, um, now this reminds me of Charlie the Unicorn. Come on, Chris, come on, let's play with us. Yeah, Chris, come play with us.
with us! Come! Yeah, it's past hundred. No, I don't <laughs> want to play. Because if my mind remembers correctly, I remember you sitting in uh, Ross's orange chair. Oh yeah, oh, oh yeah. Okay, but- I was just sitting sideways in it, like, asleep. And then I'm like, and then class was about to start, and I asked Mr. Ross, I'm like, shouldn't we be waking him up? And he's like, no, 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 it's fine, let us sleep. Oh, that was awesome. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was epic. Okay, um, um, but, um, I'll tell one more, okay, before I forget, okay? Because that was short. Yeah. Um, short and sweet. <laughs> okay, but anyway, um, this one happened, actually, during the school year. One of my friends and, we're, me, one of my friends and, and we're in math class, and what happens is that, um, like, okay, um, okay. Um, okay, anyway, um, I have a binder, and here's the problem with my binder. It, and the metal rings on it sticks out of the, the cloth, so it's sort of like a di the weapon of death. It's oh. just incredibly creepy. Okay, but anyway, what happens is that um, I fall out of my chair, and I fall my knee drove directly into one of the claws, and it was just incredibly painful. I'm like, yeah, I'm fine. Uh, and I didn't feel any pain for a second, but um, the word, but guess what happened? Huh. I looked at my knee where it didn't hurt, but he, but here's the killer. It was goring out completely. I almost had to get stitches. <laughs> it was sort of like a. Okay, um, if you if you saw a penny doing a 360, that's pretty much how deep it was. Like a half of the penny doing a 360. That's how big it the hole was. It was actually pretty deep. One of the deepest wounds I've ever had. But anyway, what- well, That was fun. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I, I'm having fun. But, um, that's pretty much the story of the binder. And I still have that injury the today. The binder. Who we'll will, who will be the now. next victim of the binder? We're gonna make that into a feature film now. It's yeah, we're gonna. By Steven Spielberg. Coming soon, The Binder, where it kills everyone that sees it. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Whoever steals notebook <laughs> paper from this <laughs> binder will die. Okay, so I just pretty much imagine my map binder with Keith just running around the town biting people's legs. <laughs> Oh, that's brilliant. All we need to make that film. Coming soon, the binder. When a lonely little kid just wanted to have a piece of notebook or it di he died. You know why? The binder. The binder. More deadly than the apocalypse and Armageddon combined. More powerful than Chuck Norris with Chuck Norris. More powerful than a hot dog combined with a sausage. This is... The BINDER! Attack! I literally just jumped from the ceiling to attack this guy. Our wither is in the lead! Yeah, but our wither is dying. Um, that's only because it, um, he's enraged. He loses like one little- No, literally, a guy was just- Oh crud! Had, like, I just realized that. He diamond sword and stuff. It was enchanted and he has like- uh, Okay, it's your, it's your turn to tell us a story. Kind of story. Um, let's go with um, um, more story. Uh, um, by that, wait, actually no. Um, um, cr um, um, funniest story. Funniest story. I know, hard, yeah. right? Um, in any way, it's a, it's a free country. And green is ahead of us now. Um, oh, it's so bad. Um, you died? No, I said I have to scream. 
switch phone sides because I'm hurting my ow, it's hurting my ear. <laughs> no, I died. You died. Yeah. Uh, fabulous job. Your phone died. My myself died. Okay, um, do you want me to go- All the rounds of applause! Okay, do you want me to- Yeah. Um, Not literally. Oh. It's the figurative applause. Metaphorical. Oh, are, are, are we gonna have to do a Lady Gaga pause? Repeatedly re- Pause, a pause, applause. I live for the applause, pause. I love- I live for the applause, pause. I live for it. No! No! Um, protect the wither! I know, I know. That's because okay, someone's coming. Okay. It's the same guy's left, and I got it! Yay! Okay, I got some armor. <gasps> I got a diamond sword! And Oh, nice! I stole a diamond! Wait, high five. High five. Do you want an extra set of armor? Can I keep it? Um, I'm good. Okay. Um, but it's your turn to tell a story. Uh, well, but that's okay. Huh? Yeah, that's better. Okay. What kind of story do you have for us, Breakin? Let's see. How about... I'm gonna go with the classics. One of my classic stories after this. Oh, I see someone! Can I make up a story? Um, no. No makeups. That's not legitimate. Aww, but then I can't have a good story! Um, maybe later, but for now, let's just stick with the truth. Okay... Wait, random question time! Oh, yeah. Um, also, by the, the way, we have a beacon. What? You have a beacon. No. I, I try to put a diamond in there. It doesn't. Wa the beacons don't work. Okay. Ready? Never. Mind. Go. Ready for a random question? Mhm. Mm Favorite TV show or animated show? You already did that one like three times. No, I didn't. <laughs> oh. Okay, fine. Uh, How about favorite reality show? Okay, fine. Reality show. Um, I really like Mythbusters. Or, okay, reality or anything that is not animated. Okay, um, I really like the Knockdown Chris movie. No, just kidding. Um, Knockdown Chris, the movie in 3D. <laughs> it's like the worst movie ever. Um, hey, baby. in 3D. <laughs> yeah, real 3D blocks. Okay. Do answer? Um, okay, um. I would have to say either The Big Bang Theory, because I love to watch it with my mom, because me and my mom, we, we love to watch TV shows. We like to watch Mythbusters and um, Big Bang Theory. Those are two of my favorites. Because they have my fondest memories of me and my, my mom. Me and my bro, what you can care with the And for me, I don't really watch much TV, but... <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Oh, really? Okay. The anime doesn't count, because I'm watching it on YouTube. Okay, so fine. That does not so count. Just this once. Uh, if I had to choose, like, non-animated TV show, um, I would have to say either... Okay, I've got three choices, I believe. Oh gosh. So, this guy takes forever. Oh my. Either face off. Like, you know, the art one like stuff. Yeah. Um so face off castle, which is like murder investigation one. Or Rizolian Isles, which is another murder investigation one. Like homicide cases and stuff because the main thing is I don't really like many TV shows, but for some reason I found an interest in like crime and murder cases. Ones. Oh come on! Like, oh you gotta be kidding me! That was so pathetic. Again? Yeah, that was it was just incredibly pathetic. 
I really hate- Okay, come to the- come to the castle. Okay. Okay, but, um, but you haven't said your story. Or do you want me to go? You can't just kill him. Oh, come on, now we're getting overrun. Oh, jeez. And our wizard died. Oh, oh, seriously? Yeah. Alright, uh, Chris, come to the castle as fast as you can. Okay. Um, oh, wait, we're losing hunger. Okay, go to the middle, go to the middle. The middle? Oh, oh, crud, we're losing hunger. Try to get to the middle. I'm, I'm trying. Go, go, go! Let me eat. Okay, enough with the story time, I guess, because this is it's kick butt time. I need a helmet if you have any. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Um, I think I have a helmet. Yep, yeah, I have a helmet. There. Go. Oh. Oh, come on! Did he grab it? No! That guy grabbed it! That's what I just said! Oh. Did he get the diamond enchanted chest plate? And you can get those from the kits if you upgrade them enough. This is like way too much of it. Okay, kill the tiger. Okay, I got her. Okay. So much lag. Okay. Okay, um. Okay, any more helmets? Um, yeah. I'm Poppy the Sailor Man. Boop, boop. I'm Poppy the Sailor Man. Okay, we're in the lead with the most players. <laughs> oh, I got this stuff. This guy's stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought of something. Oh, jeez, we got a giant mob. Oh, gosh. I have an idea. Oh, Look at all of them. Get away! Let's find the TNT to damage the rain. Okay, this has to be one the most e intense game of um of this. Yeah. I love that I'm uh, playing this song right now. Almost dead. Almost dead. Almost dead. Nope. Okay. No. No, this can't be the end of Chris. This can't be. Oh, kill the guy. Okay. Okay. No! 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 Thank you guys so much for watching that epic episode of Mega Walls. If you liked this video, click that like and the subscribe button. Anything else you want to conclude, Bacon Bug? Uh, <laughs> That's what she always says. Anyway, guys, make sure to subscribe and keep on farming, farmers. Bye bye.